What's up guys, it's the Chosen One, you know the deal. Today we're playing Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and I want to go over a couple things online, and just show you guys the difference between Quick Play and Battle Arenas. Uh, first of all, Quick Play, compete with other players online as you fight to raise your global Smash power. You can also enter as a two-person team on one system, which is really fun. If you have your friends with you, you know, you can play online with them on the same console. If you set preferred rules to on, the game will attempt to match you with players who have similar preferences. And then Battle Arenas, this is exactly what this video is going to be about. I wanted to go over Battle Arenas. Really fun feature. I like it a lot. Battle Arenas are specialized rooms where you can battle other players. You can create your own arena and you can set the rules or join someone else's arena. So this is really fun if you want to set up your own rules, make your own arena. You have a bunch of people coming in, people are watching you, spectating, and it's really fun. So you put your token in the in the ring to fight, or you stay in the spectator stands to watch. If the ring is full, hop in line. You can use the Nintendo Switch Online app to chat with others while playing. And I haven't tried this yet. I'm going to do this in an upcoming video. I definitely want to try the Nintendo Switch Online app to chat, see how it is. We'll do a little review about it. Be on the lookout for that. But let's get right into battle arenas. I'm going to show you guys how to set it up. First of all, we got join arena. Now, this is if you're looking for your friend's arena. You would go into friend's arena. If they have an open arena going, the room would show up right here. Public arenas. You know, this is where you go. You, you know, search for whatever arena you want. Set your preferences. Or you can enter ID, uh, arena ID. So you would give your arena ID to one of your friends. They could just enter this. Join your arena. Um, for the sake of this video, we're going to create a, an arena because I like doing create. I'm going to show you how I set up my, you know, arena. First of all, I set all skill levels, visibility public. You can switch this to friends if you want. If you only want your friends to, you know, see your, your arena. Uh, format one-on-one. -on -one. I always like to do a one-on-one. -on -one. Keep it simple. Rules, five stock, ten minutes, rotation, bottom one leaves. And you can name your arena. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit no. I'm going to put name it no items. Because I set no items on this arena. Just so we could get straight epic fights. People aren't running around chasing Pokeballs. And trying to get guns and stuff. Which is not a bad thing. That's the classic way to play. But let's create this arena. I like just straight epic fights. I like to test my skills rather than chasing around, running around for items. Um, let me switch up my character real quick. And for this video, I think I'm gonna pick. I think I'm gonna go with Link. Switch up the outfit. We'll go with the green, classic, Link attire. And then you can pick your stage right here, preferred stage. You're not guaranteed to get this stage. I usually have it on Corneria. And then you take your little battle coin and you put this in the arena. Someone's already waiting. Press start. And then you press A. And then as you're fighting, people will come in, spectate the fight. People will also, you know, they're going to be waiting in line. Uh, to battle the winner So let's get into it. it's gonna be really fun Basically, I feel like it's a more like you get more of an epic battle experience online in the battle arena just for the fact that um, You know you can set your own rules set your own time. It's not just like a quick battle It's a really true, you know prove yourself online the only problems I've had online so far so I've had a lot of people doing it. There's a lot of lag in this. Like, I'm pressing the button and it's like two second delay. <laughs> At least. So not only the problem I've had with online with this game is the lag. This lag is horrible right now. Uh, but it's also people quitting. You know, they get... They get eliminated early, they die early, and then they won't finish the whole fight because they feel like they're going to lose anyways. So they'll just keep jumping off. 
Nice. So they'll just keep jumping off. Yeah, look at the lagging. This is horrible right now. And this is not my game at all. This is definitely this. I, I love how he's, like, playing perfect. And, like, I'm pressing the button. <laughs> I'm inputting stuff, and it's, like, doing it, like, two seconds later. So there's definitely a lot of people that have horrible Wi-Fi. Look at this. It's it's bad. And the other problem, like I said, is people just rage quitting. They won't finish out the whole match, so just quit. Instead of actually fighting. Which is really annoying. Like, just fight, you know? Don't be a quitter. The whole point is actually fighting. If you lose, you lose, you know? Practice is how you get better. If you quit, it just makes you look stupid. But definitely a lot of communication... You know, online problems with Wi-Fi and stuff like that. There's a lot of communication problems with this online. Like I said, like the lag on this is insane. I don't know how he's playing perfect, but... I love how, like, it's not even affecting him. And I'm trying to... Like, look at my... My health is at 352. I can't even, like, do a move. I really can't even do a move. Because the lag is so bad. He's gonna win because of his horrible lag. People, a lot of people lag switch on this. They do some kind of... Something with the lag that makes them win. Like, it almost makes me, like, a couple seconds off. Trust me, it's not my... Internet at all. Because I have, like, the fastest speed. Trust me, I pay so much for internet. To get a good game experience, which sucks because other people have horrible internet, so it doesn't really matter. It's so annoying. Like, I'm, I'm really pressing these buttons and they're so late. Like, it's not even funny. Like, it's horrible. And I feel like I'm super slow. Like, what the heck? Finally. input is so bad. This lag is horrible. Of course he dodged it because I pressed it like three seconds ago. So bad. Like this will make me want to quit, but I won't. I'll still fight anyways. I'll still fight him with his horrible connection. It's making me making me lose. Look at this. This is really not fair. This is like a handicap. Get out of here. It's so bad. Like, the delay is insane. Get out of here. Nice. It's your garbage lag. Let's see if we get any rage quitters up. We'll see what happens. It might be me. Nah, I'm not gonna rage quit. I usually, <laughs> I, I never do. Nah, I usually don't. Like, there's no point. Like, I might quit if like, like something like this, like a horrible connection, or someone's just talking like crap. I don't mind talking crap, but some things that people say is like, there's no need for it, but. Some people are just annoying. Like, I'll just quit if someone's annoying, talking a lot of junk. Doesn't rarely happen, though. I usually don't encounter many people that are that annoying where I have to quit. I'm gonna make a compilation video of how many rage quitters I've had in this game. Alright, now I feel like it's getting a little faster. Now I'm able to actually fight. You see the difference? See, I'm up to speed with him, finally.
I don't know if his internet connection improved or something. And I'm actually able to keep up now. Whoa. Good block. Good block. Good block. Blocking the sword with his arm. Yeah, the lag in the beginning of this completely screwed me up. You could see it, like, chopping. Chopping up a little bit. So annoying. It's not as bad as it was, but... Definitely makes a difference. Like, it's so annoying. Get out of here. Nice. Lucky. Oh, I walked right into that. What was I thinking? Get out of here. How many times do I have to hit him to get him out? Jeez. Still so much lag, like I feel it, like. Ah, oh, this delay is so, it's coming back, it's so annoying. Like I'm pressing one direction, it's taking like a like three seconds to go in the other direction. Get out! Finally. Uh, I feel like this guy had like an unfair advantage. There's no way I'm coming back, but I still got to fight. Ah! If I would have survived and not died right there, I probably would have came back. I could have tied it up right there if I didn't get knocked off. Sucks. Look at this guy. Get out of here. Yo, I miss that every single time. That was crap. Horrible lag. Just like... It was bad. That was real bad. But I like doing the battle arena, but I just hate that. Like, just get out of the arena. This guy needs to leave. Of course, I'll probably just stay there. Well, some people leave right after the battle. His lag is just so bad. I could fight him again, but I don't want to. And I don't want to. I don't want to spectate this either. All right, I'm gonna leave that one. I'm going to recreate a new one.
That was just bad. That was just... But I'm glad I'm recording so you guys can see the just the lag. It's... It depends on who you get. I mean, sometimes you get matches like that. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes you get, like, flawless, epic matches. And sometimes you get really bad matches. Play with Cloud. Hopefully this person doesn't have any lag. Big Dogs 46. And this right here is like your preferred stage, your character, and then this would be this little badge is how many kills kills you get per you know, your kills will rack up in that. Of course I gotta fight Jigglypuff. Uh top people I hate fighting in this game, Jigglypuff, uh Yoshi, Mr. Game and Watch. I hate fighting those people. I hate this level too. Not much lag in this, which is good. I feel like he's got a decent connection. For once. Jigglypuff is a beast. If you know how to use Jigglypuff, be like ultimate that's what I love about this game is everybody's good if you know how to play with them everybody's good in their own way give me it ah oh, come on oh, stop it no not gonna hit me. That's the only thing that sucks about that finisher. So you gotta be pretty close to, to really do it. doesn't really do much damage anyway. If you're like in the middle of a big group, then it does a lot of damage. Get out of here. I don't know how Jiggly, Jigglypuff blocks my sword with her foot. If it is a girl, I don't know if it's a... It's a good match. Ooh, nice. Good knockout. Good punch. Stop running. Come on, give me that. Finally. Don't run. Don't be scared. hard to hit it and just like this as you guys can see there's no lag in this match at all it's actually a really good fight I mean it's like a little like oh crap it's like a quick millisecond lag but it's not like horrible and when you're playing on Wi-Fi I mean it's bound to happen but some people just have horrible internet like Upgrade your speeds. Now Now is the time to upgrade your uh, Wi-Fi speeds. Especially with gaming nowadays. You need a fast connection. The best connection usually. And best case, you know, best option is to uh, hardwire. But I mean, that's a problem with the Switch. 
I believe there is a hardware a hardwire setup where you can connect an Ethernet. Nice. But when you're on the go and you're playing this like out and about and you're on the Wi-Fi, it's gonna be problems here and there. But that other input, the lag with that last Captain Falcon guy that I fought, so bad. So bad. Nice. Keeps getting me with that, huh? Give me it. See, now there's lag. Nice, good block. Finally! I love Cloud Special. Beautiful. I can't wait to see what DLCs we get in this game. It's gonna be exciting. Now it's getting a little laggy. Get out of here. Ah, I keep getting hit with these charge moves. You can't block that either. She sings that lullaby. Stop running! Ah, I completely missed. Stop singing! Falling into that. I don't know how that did not hit. Oh man, that, that has pretty good range on it, huh? Get me fall asleep down there. Not bad. Jigglypuff put up a pretty decent fight. That lullaby really puts me out quick, and then, you know, she has that chance to do that hard hit and trying to knock me out. Got me out a few times. Alright, so I won that one, and then I would fight the next person. I'm gonna do this one real quick. We're gonna fight against Meta Knight. And I can tell already there's lag issues. Oh, he left. Don't be scared. I know I won't, but don't be scared. Maybe he changed his character.
And usually, sometimes I'll have like a long wait time, and sometimes I don't. Like, sometimes people will come in right away, sometimes it takes a minute. Sometimes I'll be sitting in an arena for up to 10 minutes by myself, 20 minutes sometimes. Uh, usually, after at that point, I'll just close that arena, create a new arena, and just wait for people to come in. Usually, don't have a big issue. Um, I feel like around 9 o'clock p.m. is like the best time to play. I feel like that's when everybody's on. One time I had, you know, the full spectator stands, you know, filled with people watching. The waiting arena was filled. We had all these epic battles going on. Um, and I had like five wins in a row. It was amazing. Of course, this guy's just standing here. But... Anyways, I'm going to wrap it up because I thought he was going to fight, but I guess he's scared. I'm going to wrap this video up. Hopefully, this explains to you guys what exactly a battle arena is. Um, the difference between quick play and battle arenas is in quick play, you get the global smash power or the global smash points, and you rank up. It's kind of like a little mini rank system. Um, this is a little different. I feel like I like this one better just for the fact that I get to pick my own rules. I get to do one-on-one. -on -one. It's a little longer battle rather than quick play being only four minutes, I believe. It might be seven minutes. I may be, you know, let me know in the comments below if you guys know exactly what that time is. But that's about it for today, guys. I'm going to wrap it up. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, check out my Rio video. It's up. It's on the YouTube channel. Um, what else can I say? I got a couple other Smash Brothers uh, Ultimate videos on there. Make sure you guys check that out. And what else can I say? Power Level Media, Chosen One, out. Yeah.